Oh, hello everyone, it's Yvonne here from the Aussie Goddess to do your monthly reads for the month of May. I know May's already started, I'm sorry I missed the beginning of it. <laughs> My apologies, things just were uh, a little tough for the first week of May really, end of April. But I'm here, a couple of days late, but at least I'm here. This reading is for the sign of Pisces. Pisces, this is for you. If this reading does not resonate, and remember and taking in mind that the readings flip-flop, go backwards and forwards, doesn't really matter which way, take on board what you need, but if they don't resonate, go and check out other aspects of your astrological birth chart um, because it could be your moon that resonates this month or your rising. Okay, using the Hanson Roberts deck, and we do have the Hanged Man coming out here. So Pisces, the Hanged Man talks about taking time out to look at things from a very different perspective. So sometimes this can be because you don't understand what's going on. Sometimes it can be about enlightenment, um, you know, being open-minded enough to take time out to understand something from someone else's perspective. Um, but sometimes it's about you changing your mind on something and needing time out to really look at what outcomes are coming in here because you're not really sure which way to go here. So you have the Empress coming in next. So it could be about someone in your life that you see as your one, your person, um, and trying to understand what your feelings are or what you're thinking about this person. Um we do have the Seven of Swords. It's come out a lot today and we do have a great change coming in here. So some of you are manifesting someone back into your life. Do you think you did the wrong thing by someone or someone did the wrong thing by you? Whatever it is here, Pisces, you've recognised that someone is your person. Taken a little bit of time though. It looks to me like you had to take a bit of time out to do this. But again, it could be the person you're dealing with. You could have seen them as being um, not being truthful about something. But things are changing rapidly here. You could have text messages from this person. Someone's manifesting someone here. Either you're manifesting them back into your life or they're manifesting you. Okay, so King of Wands coming out first. So you could be dealing with someone who is a Leo, Sag or Aries, but more likely this person is very passionate, good looking, a little bit sexy, um, but definitely someone you feel very good around, someone that makes you feel good when you're around them. Okay, could be dealing with a King of Cups as well, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I think this is your energy here. I think that you're in a place to offer someone love now and maybe you haven't before. Your feelings are all in whack here. You can see happiness with someone here. So Ten of Cups, beautiful. So this sort of talks about having a happy life, happy existence, having everything on your plate, all your ducks in a row. Okay, and you want to offer someone something here. You're running in here very, very quickly to offer some something to someone. Passion. Okay, Queen of Cups coming out here. So I have the Queen and the King in this reading. You've seen who you want. You've seen your counterpart, met your counterpart, and you want to offer them something very solid here. Solid future. This could be about marriage, commitment. Yet moving towards the future with someone else. There are two ones here. So you're on your way. You want to move forward with someone. I'll pull a few more cards. Could be someone from your past here with the Six of Cups. But the universe is turning things in your favour here. So the Wheel of Fortune's here. Things are about to change. So you'll be able to make this offer here. Um, there's actually quite a lot of Earth energy here as well. Uh, yeah, a lot of cups and a lot of earth. Pentacles and cups. Okay, so what I see here for you, Pisces, for the month of May is either you or someone else has realised you're the person they want to be with. They want to, one person, either you or the other person, wants to offer you stability, long-term relationship, possibly marriage. And I feel like you're right in the right place to accept this at the moment. I feel this is very reciprocated. Um, I think the other person's feeling the love back again. Um, could be someone that you've dealt with in the past, but it could also be past life relationships. So don't put too much weight on that in this reading. But the universe is ready to help you move forward here. 
um, because you're moving in very, very quickly with an offer for someone. And it is your destiny. It's definitely your destiny. And you are moving towards the person you're meant to be with. You're doing it very quickly here. Um, we had the Eight of Wands up front. I've got the Knight of Wands here. So it's happening very quickly. So you could be dealing with a fire sign, but it could just as equally be a water sign or a earth sign. I don't have any swords in this reading though, which is always a bit of a a bit of a worry because swords of course talk about communication. We did have the seven of swords there, but there's very little communication in here. Lots of action, lots of passion, lots of drive, but not a lot of talking at this point in time. So maybe you're going to land this on someone or someone's going to land in on you and it's going to go back into the throes of passion, but you need to talk about it too. And it looks like it's not happening straight away. So maybe you're waiting until everything's in place first before you make a decision to talk to them. Okay, so the card you've got here is patience. And it talks about slowing down, changing your attitude and clearing your mind. So that makes a whole lot of sense to me here because this is very, very quick action, passion oriented energy and very little talking. <laughs> so to me... I'd be doing the same thing. I'd be saying, just slow down a little bit, get yourself together. But then, Pisces, if it's someone doing this to you, it's going to be a bit of a whirlwind thing here. Um, they do have a stable offer for you. They are genuine about it. They do see you as being their person. But it may all happen very, very quickly, Pisces. Have a great May.